the South Leith Parish Church, where we come in a most important day in the lives of Douglas and Diana. We are, you come before God with ourselves as witnesses. Do you come freely and sincerely seeking marriage with one another? You do. I do.
bottle or anything. Skins. <laughs> oh my God. You know, events like today, this, this just doesn't happen. Uh, you know, we've been organising this wedding for, for months now, and it's been hard work. Well, I say we, it's really Diana that's actually done most of the work. And one of the best things about being a guy is these things do just seem to happen. I <laughs> <laughs> uh, can have a couple of champagnes and drink. And, and uh, the first memories I ever have, Duddy, actually, it's going to surprise you. Cause I can't really imagine this guy doing this, but you know, he'd be 10, I'd be nothing. And he <laughs> still am, actually. Uh, I like improvisation. Uh, the first thing I remember is actually the first thing I remember is Duddy like, gently rubbing his fingers around the contours of my face at bedtime. Uh, you know, get me off to sleep, help me shut the screaming trap, and <laughs> only that would do it. And, uh, you know, that, that was Dougie. As a brother, he was just this really loving expedition with his mate. So that makes me friendly too. This man here on my right, my loving new husband. Um, you know, I'm delighted to see his my husband. Uh, a man, a man. <laughs> and values and loyalty and I respect him so much. Um, but as Keith said, he is also an extremely silly man. <laughs> if you don't know that already. <laughs> and he does make me laugh. Yes, so. <laughs> and I'm just so proud and pleased to be standing here as his wife um, today. And I've waited a long time for him. But he's definitely been worth waiting for. So that's the good news. Um, <laughs> I to say one, we all say two and three together. Okay? So one, two, three, cut. Beautiful, beautiful.
Ladies and gents, a huge round of applause for Brighton Groom.